Hey guys, it's Bank for About PC Gaming here, about to try out the Rebatuna Statistic Server Update 6.6.0. .6 this now has the ability to display Vulcan while in gameplay, which is great for people like me who do an um, in game performance um, video. So, as you can see, I'm playing Doom at 4K using the Ultra preset, the exact same settings that the AMD Vega demo used. So, it's nice to have um, the MSI Afterburner and Rebutuna Statistic Server working in Vulcan. You can have a true look at how the cores are loaded up and also um, how well your graphics card is doing. Um, so, if you guys want, I may do a Vulcan versus um, OpenGL using the MSI Afterburner overlay now. So, you'll have a good look at how the cores work under load with uh, Vulcan versus OpenGL and obviously if there's a performance difference as well. So, um, you know, you may have seen some of my videos in the past um, criticizing early performance of the AMD Vega GPU in terms of not that it was bad, but just that it wasn't doing as well as I would have thought it was. Um, but, you know, there's still a lot to come and there's still a lot we don't know. But as you can see, the GTX 1080 on it by itself doing very well in Doom at 4K using the exact same settings and I would also like to note I may have two GTX 1080s in the system but as you can see only one is getting taken advantage of because Vulkan does not take advantage of multi GPU solutions so let's just get that clear but um, a single GTX 1080 overclocked thousands, founders edition um, only at around 2 gigahertz so nothing special um, a decent aftermarket cool GTX 1080 can do um, 1900 megahertz or even higher out the box so nothing really a good aftermarket cool GTX 1080 would not do so you know it will be interesting to see what Vega brings to the table as we know Doom heavily favors um, AMD hardware and um, you can obviously see that across the board from the RX 480 and some previous GPUs like the Fury X as well. Fury X almost matching the GTX 1080 just to show you how well it does and how well it favors AMD's um, obviously architecture and that's mainly due to the addition of um, asynchronous compute which this game does take advantage of so you know GTX 1080 doing very well considering um, it's not optimized at the, at the best to take advantage of, of you know the software available but I'm liking the performance got no complaints here and um, I'm gonna shut up now and let you guys enjoy the rest of the video as always thanks for watching
Welcome to the UAC. Now 221 accidents in the day.